title of this writing is Believe It or Not. The following is a grasshopper musing from many moons ago. Beliefs get results. Now, before you go out and put that on a bumper sticker, let me caution you that you may not like the results. Most of us have heard that we act in accordance with our beliefs. Best as I can tell, that's pretty close to the truth. What we may not be aware of are the results our beliefs deliver. If you pretty much find yourself in the same hole over and over again, you can bet it's the result of a belief you have. The converse is also accurate. If you find yourself in a place of peace over and over again, it's the result of a belief. Ask any person you consider to be serially lucky, and you're going to find a belief in luck. They filter their experience for luck. The same is true for the glass is half empty person. They'll continually find life to be half empty. It's the result of a belief. If beliefs get results, the question you want to be asking is, are my beliefs getting me the results that I want? Warning. We steadfastly hold dearly to our beliefs in spite of overwhelming evidence that they aren't getting us the results we want. It's like trying to keep from drowning by holding on to an anvil. Socrates left us with an assertion worth pondering. The unexamined life is not worth living. It could easily be extrapolated that his saying equally applies to our beliefs. What results are you consistently getting that you can tie back to a belief? Our belief about money is one of the most apparent to me in our culture. Reminds me of a story. I used to work for a man who had an uncanny knack for making money. Some would call him lucky, but his good fortune went deeper than random luck. What I found after having numerous conversations with him on the topic was that he had a belief that he deserved to make a lot of money. I remember jokingly saying to him that he could parachute nude into an unfriendly country with a derogatory saying about that country's leader tattooed on his chest, and within a week, he would own a business there. <laughs> beliefs get results. What results are you getting? Are you willing to examine your beliefs? I know people who get what they pray for. And I know just as many who don't. What's the difference between the two? The successful ones are the people who examine their beliefs and bravely let go of the ones that are taking them down. You have to be willing to entertain that you're wrong about something, even if you've shouted it from the rooftops your entire life. Willingness opens the door to inspection. From there, it's pure deduction. Either your belief is working for you or it's not. True or false? Your life is predetermined. It is if you believe it is. It's not if you believe it's not. Are you willing to do what's necessary to get the results you want? It's a matter of belief. All the best, John.